Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Siri here again, and as you can see, we're about to do a back to school haul. So it's September, it's that time of the year again, and kids are going back to school. So my baby is actually going to school for the first time. Like I can't believe this. Like she's not yet two years, she's about 18 months, and she'll be resuming nursery school. And you would ask me why all of this for a nursery child. But just follow me as I show you guys what I got for this back to school session. First thing is her school bag. So this school bag comes as a set it's a three-in-one set this is the bag this is a lunch box and this is a pencil case so my mother-in-law bought this for her as her present for back to school which is absolutely lovely and i really appreciate it but the bag is way too big like she's still small so i feel i'm going to be keeping this i'm thinking i'll still use this lunch box because yeah there's nothing wrong with it but like i'll keep the main bag and the pencil case and as she grows she can use it also like i think this is also a very good hand luggage especially because like it's a wheel bag so literally like she can just pull it around and i feel like she'll get the best use for it as she grows and then pending that she would use it as a travel luggage so because of that i bought her another school bag which is way smaller i love it's literally her size, nothing serious, it's just the bag and yeah, it also has wheels, so it's perfect. What is she carrying to school? It's not just food, diaper, change of clothes and stuff, so yeah. This is her, this is, going to, this is basically going to be her main school bag for now. Then before I bought all of this, this is one of the first things I bought for her. I saw this in a supermarket, I fell in love and it was so affordable. And this is basically a lunch box. So she has like a lunch pack or a lunch box, whatever. So she has two. This is a bag, this is another one. And this one, the good thing is that it's plastic. So literally like you can wash it every single day, unlike this cloth one. And then it already comes with like a pack, there's even a spoon in there and a bottle. So I felt yeah, it will still be handy. But as the obsessed mother that I am, I still bought her more. So I bought her this other lunch box. I really like like simple design lunch box type things. So yeah, I got her this one. It's a two compartment thing and it has a spoon as well. I got this from Ebano, but I'm sure you can get it from the local market. And I got this other one, which is basically the exact color as the first one from another store, it's like a kitchen store and this one is just a single compartment and the spoon is over here yeah, just press it down and then you have your spoon and fork over here that's the nepa it's the inverter that is screaming so I also bought her this other lunch box which is basically the Pema ones, like a food warm and it has a spoon quite a big spoon actually in there and last but not the least I got her these food containers I intend on using this to like pack her fruits and it's like a set of four so when I want to pack fruits I don't want like fruits to make the other food soggy so I'll just pack fruits for her in here I got this from Minoso actually I'm just trying to remove this, show you the size. Like, it's really cute and small. They have different colors, but like, yeah, you can just see if I put grapes for her. If I want to put two different fruits, I can still pack two. But like, I just felt like it's really cute and small. And I like the fact that her main food will not be soggy up. Then I got her this water bottle. I really like it. I've been looking for a bottle that doesn't have a straw or doesn't have that thing that they would drink from which usually retains dirt and yeah so i got this one it's quite yeah it's a thermal one so you keep whatever cool or warm if you want to give her like hot chocolate it has a rope in there for the bottle so she can actually hang it on her neck i'm looking for another bottle that is similar to this if i don't find i'll just go back to it and buy a different color because all the ones i've been seeing they're not even strong so they are plastic so she can easily break them and they are also expensive so i really like this so that's it for 
bags and lunch boxes now moving on to like clothing items hmm. it as well so obviously as kids they required to wear black shoes i got had this pair of black shoes which i got from pep store and then when i got it this was the only design that had her size it's not even her size this is 26 and my baby wears 22 so you can imagine but like pop socks and everything should be fine we tried it on but like this was like the only one and this was the price is actually still there six thousand four hundred this was the only style or only design so i was waiting for them to have more stuff for me to go they don't have more stuff and all the stuff they have are like bigger sizes so i'm still looking for a second black pair for her then i got her trainers for um their exercise day i think wednesday i got her four pairs but she's currently wearing one so i'll show you guys another time but this is one of them i really love them. i bought all of them from pep store actually i really love this pair of shoes like i'm so in love like if i was a child i would love to wear this, this is actually her size 22 but like it's a big 22 then i got her this other one which i really like i like the fact that it's so soft this is size 23 and then i got her this one that is really big she can't even start wearing it but i was so in love like oh my gosh this is a 26 so she may not wear it in like late next year but like the prices were good they had like a promo where the more stuff you get the cheaper it was and like just ran for like four so currently like this white one and one blue one that she's currently wearing are actually the sizes for now and then from next year she'll be able to start wearing these other ones then um for socks this was the first pack of socks i had gotten it had white black and pink but they're only allowed to wear white and black and i think black is only on sports day so the white one in here still has like three um pairs because she's still wearing one of them so she, these are like six for the white and black then I got her more socks i got this dozen of white socks from the market then I got her this long one from Pep Store. I also got her this black long one from Pep Store. Then I got her pop socks. So there was like a pack like this, but this is, they're like way longer than her. But when they wear it up, there's a way to still fit. So this was like the smallest size. For white ones, I got a pack of two. For the black ones, they didn't have the cotton one. This is the material they had. So I just took one. Because I feel like I would still find. Then I bought this other black one from Pep Store. I'm hoping they won't disturb her with this because it's more like charcoal grey. So if they don't disturb her, then I'll get more. So that's it for socks. Then my mom got her this pack of briefs on these when she travels to France and then these other ones. So like this is a pack of seven, this is a pack of five, and these are another four. So it's quite a lot. It's almost like 20 20 pants so she's good to go then i also got her this pack of inner wear it's a slip suit like the one you can clip down it's a pack of five then when i went to cameroon went to the market baby girl and i started screaming when she saw these um character inner she was literally like screaming that she wants them so i bought three for her so that makes it eight packs separate from like the plain whites that she already has at home so she has enough inner wares then in her school they don't allow beads so the only thing i got for her hair are rubber bands which depending on how we use i got this one from pep store which was 800 naira because the price is still on and i got these other packs from you know so i think they were one nine each so yeah that closes it for clothing then i got her um obviously kids now for their snacks so i got two packs of the chiquita exotic which is like the small cartons you know. yeah this one's this size i like this particular one because it's not very sweet i've not been giving like very sweet things to my baby and i want to maintain that so i got her these packs so in a carton it's 24 so i got two cartons for that that's for today then i bought caprison because yeah all kids love caprison so i got her one carton which has about how many pieces 40 so all of this should last her i want to think that it should last her for this term but let us see how long 
to the last so i got these containers i got this one for the fridge because i want to put her fruits in there so i already got her grapes but when i'm going out today i'll get her more fruit her apples her dad bought her bananas yesterday so just wash her fruits and put them in here so when i'm putting it in the fridge nothing else touches her fruits especially for the ones that are open like the bananas can enter the other part of the fridge but like her apples her grapes her tangerines her strawberries i just want all of them to be in here i also got her this pack of biscuits I don't know if you see it. this pack it's uh, the magnetic zone but actually it's half carton of uh, digestive and half carton of the um crackers magnetic crackers i still want to get another type of biscuit but i'm looking for something that is not sweet because like i said i don't really have very sweet things then i've had this container where we'll be putting her snacks for the day so i'll just bring out some of the drinks arrange them in here and put it out so yeah i got this container from minuso and it's 25 this one as well from minuso 25 so yeah i just felt like it's quite airtight and nothing will be able to enter nothing will be able to enter they're really cute but i don't like keeping things inside cartons all of these will go into the store but then i'll arrange hers in this one for the week so yeah other than that i got her a pack of pencils just for her to use at home i also got her a pack of colors but she has already opened it i don't even know if she dropped it there's i have another like a bigger one of the transparent uh, packs like this where i keep all her stationaries i already arranged that i also arranged her room to be basically just setting up everything for back to school so we're going to wash like her lunch boxes wash some of these things all the rest like they get cleaned up and put in her uh cupboard so yeah these are the things i bought for baby girl for back to school um i know i didn't say so many prizes because controversy controversy but like just know that back to school things are expensive i know that this bag this set of three my mother-in-law got it for a very good price because she bought it like i think in march <laughs> so you can imagine and she got them for like eighteen thousand, and i got this small one alone for twelve thousand because i just bought it now so you can just imagine like the nuances so yeah so this is basically what we're getting for baby girl for back to school get ready to see more school content when i take her for school jobs and pickups and stuff but uh, yeah hope you enjoyed this video please make sure to like give us a thumbs up yeah and do subscribe leave a comment in the comment section down below share the people around you and i'll see you in my next video